Hey YouTube, it's Mike playing Gangster, and today I'm bringing you guys my Sunday highlights. Today's budget is going to be around $400. We are going to buy into the best possible tournaments that we could with the bankroll that we have for this Sunday. Hopefully I get to show you guys some of the best highlights. At the moment, we only have two tables going. We're waiting for a few tournaments to uh, open in. Right now we're playing the $25 Sunday Grand Prix, the $30 Sunday Marathon. We're going to most likely are going to play the 80, Crazy 88 uh for sure we're playing the 54 main uh most likely take a shot at a satellite and most likely some other tournament here and there but you know more or less we're going to see throughout the day what we're going to pick and choose and hopefully we're going to run good and show you guys some of the best highlights of the day so we got our first uh real situation here we got ace king off suit we got we we basically open e3 bet he called I'd rather just shove you with Ace King off. Worst case scenario, it's very early in this tournament. We're gonna rebuy if we just walk into a monster. But yeah, let's go for a big stack early on in the $25 Sunday Grand Prix. I'm assuming this is a pocket pair. I don't think this is gonna be that strong. This guy most likely will have a pocket pair though. Let's see if he folds or he calls. He does call, so what type of pocket pair do you have? Pocket Queens. Okay, so we need an ace or a king. Oh boy, not looking good. It looks like we may have to rebuy. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to rebuy. $25 tournament. Okay, so we got a situation here. We opened uh, Pocket Deuces. He called. We C bet. He 3 bet us. We're going to call. We hit a boat. Uh, we're playing a little spin and go here. $20 spin and go. Uh, yeah, let's go all then here. King three. Two big blinds. So this is the tournament that we just busted with Ace King. Will be nice to uh, chip up here. He's betting big, which is nice. So we are out of the spinning goal. It was a $20 spinning goal. So we're going to call. No point in raising. Let's hope this guy has the flush here. Because we have a boat. Let's just hope it's not a cooler and he has like jack eight or something. So we bought in twice in this tournament. So if we would double up here, that would be nice. Basically bought in for two stacks. So he does bet. I don't see him like folding here for 10 big blinds. Either way, it's a, it's a double up. Ace, jack. So we do get the full double. So we get our money, well, I mean, our chips back, but we paid twice, right? Hopefully we can continue it. Okay, so we officially entered the uh, satellite. We haven't had a hand here yet in the $30. I see 20 hands, fold every single hand. But we entered the 525 World Festival satellite for $54. We got King, Queen of Arts. We're going to rip it in here. And hope to run good. We got 11 big blinds. So whenever you play satellites, you start off with 5k in chips. We just basically entered. And we get our first, I guess, our first hand. So we got we got our, our first defend in the $30. This is a weird tournament. Um, as you can see, we played 21 hands. It's the first hand we play. We're going to defend ace three. We do hit top pair. Uh, this guy does open under the gun. So I'm not sure how good our ace is going to be here, but it's going to be kind of hard to basically get away here with top pair. We're going to call. There's no point in raising. I'd like to see a three though. I wonder if if he checks if I should block bet the the river. Yeah, I think we're gonna block bet the river. We're gonna fold in the satellite. So we do pick up our first and in the thirty dollars marathon. Okay, well we got an and in the satellite. Pocket jacks. We're going to be ripping it in. 
kind of hoping someone opens. Nobody opens. We're going to open shove here, pocket jacks. I just don't see myself like opening for two big blinds. Let's hope somebody has something to give us some action. We're not going to play many satellites today. Most likely this will be the only one to be honest with you. Because we do want to enter again the crazy 88 and the 54 main. Okay, so we do get action. Pocket jacks versus ace king. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Okay, we got to avoid 18% for our first double up. Can we do it? Yes, we do. I thought it was an ace, man. I won't lie. I thought it was an ace. Okay, well, we got an all-in in the $30 um, marathon. As you can see, we only played 8%. We just haven't really had many hands here. We did play one hand that I didn't show you guys, which we hit uh, bottom pair and we had to fold. Now we got pocket eight, so we're all in. We still have to enter the crazy 88, <laughs> which we are going to be entering very, very soon. So we do win that one. Okay, well, we got a situation here in the satellite. We got king, queen of diamonds. There's 25 seats. So these are hands that we're going to have to win. Let's see what happens here. So we do win it. No action. Okay, so we got a blind versus blind here. I think I'm going to play this very, like, crazy for some reason. <laughs> Look, guys. Uh, this guy's been opening every um, every every button possible. Uh, so when he opened, this guy called. We three bet. We hit the pair of eights. We checked. He bet. We called. We're gonna try to represent the pair of ten here. Let's see what happens. We're all in. Of course, we're bluffing, hoping that he doesn't have it, and he doesn't. Thank God. Okay, well, blind versus blind in the $30 marathon. Again, only 11% hands are played. We don't have much. We have king, queen. We haven't really been uh, card lucky at all. So hopefully we can win with king, queen here. He does have an ace eye, so we're going to have to hit something. Let's hit something. I don't know. This tournament has not been our tournament. Yeah, so we're out of the $30 marathon, unfortunate. Uh, this guy raise we call this guy goes all in of course. We're gonna fold here with the ace uh, six of arts We're gonna enter the 88 crazy 88 and of course the 54 main just started. We're gonna enter it a little bit later on Okay, so we entered the 88 crazy 88 uh, We got pocket trees here in the satellite of course. We're gonna go with it. It's a pair uh, Yeah, we're gonna go with it We are going to go with the threes here and hope that we run good. You gotta win. You gotta win all ins and satellites. So when you have a pair, going for it is not a bad idea. And hope that you chip up. You start with five k in chips. We have a little over eight thousand. So this guy ends up raising. Now you could call and set mine, but I kind of run it. Kind of want to go all in because it's very very hard to play threes uh, on the flop if you don't hit a set right. So let's go all in here. Pocket threes. Good luck to us. Let's hope he doesn't have a monster. He doesn't. But as you can see, if we don't go all in, it's going to be very, very hard to play, right? We do have also pocket sixes here. Let's play the pocket sixes here in the $25 Grand Prix. You start with 50k. We have almost three starting sacks here. So that's the one that we bought in twice. Um, let's see if we can continue running good here. Well, okay. Okay, well, we got King Eight of Spades here. He's been playing a lot of hands. We're going to rip it in here with King Eight and hope that he folds. Oh boy, he calls. We're going to have to hit. He's got Ace Queen. We're still alive, though. Uh, not looking good. Not looking good. We need a Seven or a Queen to stay alive. Ah, 
Ah, we tried. We tried. He actually I have a monster. 53% guy playing every hand possible. But, hey, it is what it is. Well, we got our first hand here in the 88. We opened the pocket nines. Oh, boy. I guess we're going to fold. I guess this has to be strong, right? Ace. I was expecting way better than ace queen, though. I was expecting way better than ace queen there. We actually have the best hand. Yeah. I'm fortunate, man. Ah, that kind of sucks. Okay, well, we got an all in situation here. Can Ace King give us a first bounty? <laughs> it's pretty early on in this tournament. We're going to go for it. We got Ace King suited. He's got pocket jacks. Can we win a flip? <laughs> we haven't won a flip today, man. Wow, it's brutal. It's very, very brutal if we don't hit an Ace or a King here. We don't. Hey, man, when all your big hands don't hit, it's very, very hard to make money. Well, we got pocket eights in the 44. We're full here. Was it a five? Nope. We're going on break after this hand. We're going to enter the 54 main if we lose in this one. Well, we're going to enter the 54 main no matter what, regardless, but let's hope we could win with pocket eights here. We haven't won many flips at all today, so this could be a very early Sunday today. Yeah, today could be a very early Sunday. We're just not running good at all. Maybe a heart on the river? Maybe? Nope, no heart. I don't know, man. We're just not winning nothing. Okay, well, we got pocket fives in the 88. Um, raise, called. I think... I think we could shove here with pocket fives. We're not running really, really well <laughs> today. So most likely somebody calls, we're going to end up losing. But hey, you got to believe. You got to believe sometimes. Some Sundays are just not going to go your way. But let's not be negative. We're going to win with the fives. You see? We win. Okay, well, we got pocket nines. Crazy 88. <clears throat> we haven't had really that many hands. You start with 10,000 in chips, so it's not like we have, like, um, very bad but we haven't really had many hands early on the guy did this with ace queen not this guy but early on the same scenario we had pocket nines we folded i think this time we're just gonna go for it man if it's her time to win it's her time to win if it's not we're gonna focus on the other tournaments we still got the 25 dollar uh Grand Prix that's looking decent and the 54 we're gonna do at least two bullets in there it's one million guaranteed so let's hope we're not facing something better we are unfortunate and man today I don't know what to say I honestly don't know what to say today give this guy a set nope <laughs> 3.9 big blinds left today is not a good day for poker for me we are going to go all in here with seven, six of spades. Would love to show you guys a win here and there, but unfortunately today so far, wow, it's been brutal. It's been very, very brutal. As you can see, <clears throat> we're just not winning uh, all ins. We're just not having any success at all. We do have a, hey, we won. <laughs> We won an all in. Let's do the same thing here with with Ace Deuce. <laughs> Come on, man. Let's run it up, man. Let's win back to back all ins. Give us both times a flush. Let's put us back into the game. Three thousand one hundred. 
Start with 10k. If this guy calls, we have a chance of going back to seven seven thousand. We're actually ahead, man. We're actually ahead. Oh boy. They have to give him all the outs. Oh ho! Double up. Back to back. Okay, well, we got a situation here in the um 25 Sunday Grand Prix. We opened this guy three bets. Of course, we're gonna shove you with Ace King. And he folds. Well, we pick up the chips at least. We're doing good here. We start with 50,000 chips. We have a little over four starting stacks. Hopefully, maybe we could do a, a run here. Okay, well, we got King Jack here in the 88. Let's open here. Of course, I mean, I kind of had a feeling that was going to happen. I kind of had a feeling that was going to happen. Oh, do I really want to run it with King Jack? Probably not. Probably not. The thing is, we don't have much chips, man. You start with 10k, we have half a stack. We're not running very, very good. We hope maybe we're flipping if he has like a pocket pair, but to be honest with you, I don't know. He does have a pocket pair. We're going to 3 bet there. We hit the king here. Let's hope we could hold. We're going to be 3 betting in the other one. So we do old with King Jack. That's nice. Actually, you know what? We're going to rip it in because these guys are short. We're going to rip it in. Wow, here, what happened here? Let's call the pocket sixes there. Lots of action happening. So we, we first, for the first time, we have actually a little over a starting stack in the 88. So this guy does call. He's got pocket tens. Can we win a flip with Ace King? <laughs> can we win one flip? So far, it's looking good. But can we hold the river? And it looks like we are going to hold the river. So we win our first Ace King flip. Which gives us uh, a big stack here in the um, in the 25. This guy goes pretty big here. This guy goes pretty big here. I mean, is this always ace queen? I think we have to call at least one time. I don't know, man. Sometimes people with big stacks like to bluff because they have the chips for it. Open raise. I don't know, man. I just feel like this could be ace king, man. Like that, ace king. I mean, most likely I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Most likely I'm wrong, but I, I just feel like we're going to rebuy worst case scenario, but man, I don't know, man. I just feel like this could be ace king. Oh, called pretty quick. Kings. It's kings. We're going to need a six. Oh, it looked like a six. Guys, I know that's a bad call, but sometimes you go you go with your gut. Unfortunate, my gut was wrong. Very, very wrong. But hey, we tried. Oh, we got Ace King in the 88. We are gonna rebuy here. We are gonna rebuy here. We are gonna rebuy here. We're gonna open with the Ace King. We rebought in the 54. Let's hope we go good. We do good in the 88 because we haven't had. Any caches, any bounties, nothing so far today. So it's it's been a very bad day. We're, we're out of doubt. Today's just not. I'm not playing the greatest, but I'm not playing the worst in a way of saying like when I get in it in, sometimes we're just not really hitting much. Um okay, so we have top pair with the ace king here. Of course, we're gonna continue betting. <clears throat> Let's hope my opponent has some sort of some sort of hand here so we can get paid. Okay, we're gonna check the turn. Um, not too crazy about the seven. Not too crazy about the seven. I mean, eight, 10. Could also have seven, five. He could have an ace. 
what I'm a bit afraid of, oh my god. <sighs> I mean, I don't see myself winning this hand now. I feel like he could have a lot of different types of 10s in his hands. How do you fold, though, man? How do you fold top pair here, man? Could have a 5, of course, also. Bet pretty, pretty quickly. Uh, he probably has it. He probably has it. He has two pairs. Same thing, man. He just has it. Man. Ah. We got ace. Ace queen over here. It's not looking good today. Let's hope these guys fold. It doesn't fold, but we do pick up the, the queen on the turn. We're going to bet big. Of course he calls we're gonna shut down because most likely it's a flush he doesn't thank god got a big pot here in the 54 we also have um top pair here but the queen in the 88 check well well we got the we got the top boat I think we're gonna call here man it's bet small see maybe if we get called kings could have went all in maybe who knows yeah we're calling here with ace 10 oh nice okay no spade please what? What? The thing revealed itself? I didn't even click that thing. Okay, we win a big pot here in the 54. Thank God. Okay, well, we got King Jack here in the 88. Um, 10 big blinds. I, I think it's pretty good. King Jack suited here. Uh, this guy's open shoving, so he could have also a lot of pocket pairs. Doesn't automatically have me dominate every time here. So we're going to call here with King Jack and hope that we run good. Pocket eights. We're flipping. We hit the king. Okay, we gotta avoid two hates. And we do. Wow. Okay, we're getting lucky a few times here in the 88. We're 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 staying alive. <laughs> okay, we got a6. We're gonna be ripping it in here. We're going to be ripping it in here in the 88. Ace-6 suited. He gets called. Oh, boy. Ace-9. We're going to need Ace-6. An 8. Interesting call, though. Ace-9, though. Interesting call for sure. I don't know if that's a call. I don't know. Anyway, he won. We're out of the 88. Uh, boom, boom. Let's check. We're going to call the bet. He doesn't bet. I mean, I guess we make him bluff. I don't see him opening a hand where he has something here besides a busted flush draw. Or unless he had a pocket pair in his hands. I think he has a busted flush draw. I think we're going to call here. King 8. He hits the straight on the river. I thought he had a busted flush draw. That's exactly what he had. But he had the king 8 for a straight on the river. We have an all-in situation here. We got to fade an 8. An 8 only. Can we do it? Yes, we do. We win our first $12 today. <laughs> Believe it or not, that's, that's the first $12 we win today. Now, we do have a uh, more than a double stack here in the uh, 54. But, yeah, that's actually our first $12 of the day. We, we have $400 in buy-in. It's, it's not going that well. <laughs> Let's just say that. We got two tournaments left. The 54, of course, which is the main, which is a very good one. And, of course, the 25, which we don't have many big blinds. 18 big blinds left. Top 1,003 get paid. We're going to try our best to get it in. Um, 
the best we can then hope we win okay guys we got ace six here in the 25 we're going to be shipping it in here there's a short stack here hopefully one of these guys doesn't wake up with a hand we were doing so good in this tournament there's a hand i didn't show you this hand but um Ended up like losing like half my stack versus someone that had a uh, puck pair and I had ace jack. Walk into ace 10. <laughs> ah, what a day, what a day. The end, the end of the 25 Sunday Grand Prix could be, could be here. Oh man, today, today is very, oof. I, I would say. I, I haven't played great, but I would also say that I haven't been very, very lucky uh, overall. So, anyways, we're all in with Ace Deuce off for 2.8 big blinds. Can we keep the tournament alive? You should call pretty much any tool, right? For 1.8 big blinds. If he folds, that would be kind of like... Okay, he does. Seven big blinds. Come on. Can we win seven big blinds? We hit the Ace. We hit the queen. Well, we don't hit the queen, but the queen hits. So we win. Finally, we win a little double up here. Okay, we got 9-8. It's definitely not the best hand, but we're going to go with it. We got 6.7 big blinds. We are all in here with a connected hand. 9-8. We believe in 9-8, man. We believe in 9-8. We haven't been doing great with the big hands. Maybe with the mediocre hands, like 9-8, we're going to do good. So this guy calls. My Canadian friend. Let's hope it's not a pocket pair and it's an ace-king or something, ace-queen. So we're flipping. Not flipping, but you know what I mean. We have, we're live. Come on, don't give me a pocket pair. Ah, of course it's aces. Give me a straight. What a beautiful flop for a hand, but unfortunate. Yeah, such a monster. 25. We were doing great in this one, but unfortunate. A couple bad situations ended up costing us the tournament. We don't cash. We got one left. One tournament left. One tournament left. In the background, we're playing a little game here. One tournament left with almost three stacks. A little bounty of $12. Or if not, we are going to be completely dead. We're all in with six high. <laughs> we went for the bounty. Unfortunate. Uh, we actually walk into a hand. Oh, you know what? We may have a chance here. I know you guys are going to look at this like, oh my God, what are you doing with six, four guys? We try to move. It didn't work. We got caught and we are out. Today's been brutal. Uh, overall, just a brutal day. Um, I didn't play. I didn't play great. Um, this guy opened. The guy had 10 big blinds. Um, I figured I could like just you know ship it and go for the go for the bounty. Maybe this guy was trying to like whatever. Look, the, the move was bad. Um, yeah, today was just very bad. Today was very very bad. Um, twelve dollars. That's it. We we bought in for four hundred. We cashed twelve dollars. Twelve dollars and fifty cents. It was just one of those Sundays. Uh, I don't I don't feel like I played great. I don't feel like I run good too. Like I mean, there were certain spots where whatever we got it in. You know, like flips and stuff that i like you know like just the, the 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 regular flips you know like ace king versus queens or whatever ace king versus ace uh ace queen or whatever the case may be like sometimes we're ahead sometimes we're behind but you know like whatever like it is it is what it is man sometimes you just gonna run good sometimes you gotta run bad unfortunate today was just one of those days where again like a mix of everything i didn't play great i didn't run good um yeah i mean you know sometimes you're like oh which sunday should i skip this, this Sunday would have been a good day to skip, you know? <laughs> it is what it is. I want to show you guys the reality of poker sometimes. Sometimes you just have no caches, and sometimes you just go bust. And I, and like I said, like I basically um, don't go over my limits. Today my limit was a uh, $400 bankroll. I didn't want to uh, go for more than that because uh, I didn't have a great week. So I decided to basically uh, give myself a smaller bankroll. Sometimes I go a bit higher, sometimes even smaller, all depending how the week goes and stuff like that. Unfortunately... The last week, week and a half hasn't been that great. So I decided to go a little bit smaller with $400 buy-ins. We tried to buy into the best possible tournaments that we could have bought in for like that kind of like bankroll. Unfortunate, like I said, like 
the combination of a few things not going right and not playing great, we ended up like, you know, getting a $12 cash. That's it. So that is what it is. Hopefully next week, we're going to run better than this week. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day, guys. Bye-bye.